it was like not detecting the the nonsense not detecting the nonsense the the, the actual the the obis the obs the wasn't obs. detecting the obs okay I got out of the shower. I ran down here. Uh huh. I was like a minute late, but that's. I feel like there was another step in there, at least, thankfully. I put clothes on. Is that yes, what you that's mean? The step. That's no, my the step. I got my winky out. Okay. Actually, you know what? It doesn't. Either two, one of the two things are true. Either I mm -hmm. I'm here naked, and I'm right. gonna get demonetized. Sure. Or I shower with my clothes on like a weirdo. I'm not sure which is worse. <laughs> Cause I feel like one is just inappropriate. The other one might indicate I eat people. I don't... <laughs> <laughs> like... These cold opens are getting out of hand, Dave. Did that. <laughs> uh... All right, so I got a spicy build of a deck I don't know how to play. Okay. In that I, I basically Maybe we should have just a vanilla build of the deck that you don't know how to play so that you can then add the spice later. No. That's the wrong button. Change decks. <laughs> uh, just snake eyes. Select deck. Decks. Just Monica? And uh, do we... I guess, do we have to... Do we pick stuff or do we go in like we don't... Like with nothing equipped? Do we pick stuff? Yeah, like the accessories. I mean, I think you gotta you gotta pick the accessories. All right, we're gonna pick the dual case twenty twenty four. We're gonna pick. Are you gonna like try to cosplay as tryhard or someone who doesn't know what they're doing? All right, we're gonna pick the legendary dragon of white, the there blue eyes field. There you go. The blue eyes thing. Now this is a man who has no idea what he's doing. Uh, the blue eyes mausoleum coin. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. But we do got to change our main three cards. The first, this middle one is definitely going to be what's her face. This one is going to be. Let's go with this little guy. And this one is going to be our spicy tech option. That chord. <laughs> Yes, it is. <laughs> okay. Okay. If they don't quit when I activate Poplar, they're going to quit when I activate <laughs> Gores. <laughs> <laughs> all right. All right. <sighs> then I'll let him, let him cook. I was running like shit. Yeah. Dave Burton the meal. <laughs> you let him cook too much. I got home, I made grilled cheeses for the two of us, and I burnt my grilled cheese, so that's... Don't let him cook. Don't let him hey, cook. Hey, look, full combo. Right? Double mix, this he's kind of This is why I fork. cook and Dave doesn't. <laughs> I'm actually a very good cook, for the record. I mean, I were just talking, so I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> I can't do two things at once. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, I guess you activate Maxi against Fusion Destiny. That, that is what you would uh, you would do. That yes. Um. Oh yeah, you and Amanda need to figure out what I'm cooking you uh, when I'm over there. Uh, as long as it's not one of the two of us. What? To so make sure it's both of them. But, yeah. Hey, oh, drew no. bonfire. Ah, you, have, you got bonfire? Yes. No, I'm saying I'm going to make you dinner. Yes, I know. And you're going to like it. And you're going to like it. Yeah, of course he's going to like it. I'm the best chef on earth. He's the best. I don't know what you uh, imperm here. I'm not you sure. might just wait until just, just your leave. turn 
imperm the the uh, stupid fusion. Yeah. Because then that kind of forces it out. Yeah, because he's got to blow himself up for nothing. <laughs> mm -hmm. He didn't even do anything. Well, you max seed. I guess that's true. He did more than he probably. He's like, I don't want this. I don't want this guy to draw the blue eyes white dragon. <laughs> nope. Uh, yeah, I guess. Uh... Imperm this asshole. Yeah. He's gonna have to chain. And one other card on the field. Sure. Probably your imperm, right? I guess you can blow up. Cool. Uh, Ash bait? Uh, yeah. He didn't have nothing. So I have Ash in hand, so I might as well get Oak. So get, no, get Poplar. Because I'll just, Poplar. It'll just activate. And then use Poplar to search the field spell? I'm not. I don't think I'm running it. No, you should. And you what do you mean be not playing the field spell? Yeah, you should be running the field spell and the... Um, and the one that puts cards in the back row. So, we gotta fix the deck. <clears throat> okay. That's fine. And you can search out... Uh, Div Incarnate. That's fine. Uh, activate, uh, search, or summon, uh, Link Karibo with Poplar. <clears throat> and then put Poplar in the back row, and then use Original Sinful on Ash <clears throat> to summon Oak. And then activate Oak's effect to bring back Ash. Cute. Then use Ash's effect, now that it's no longer negated, to summon Flamberge with Link Karibo. It's gross that it's in my hand. That's fine. Okay. Ooh. And you could you could uh, use his effect on what's his face to put it back in the back row. Deals with it. Yep. Okay. Uh, then I IP so right. Now you're gonna want to uh, yes yes IP activate Flambridge's effect. Summon Oak and Ash. And, a, and then, so the field spell also makes these little guys gain attack. You can actually use them to for battle damage. Okay. Yeah, like a thousand attack. So it's nothing, nothing to stick a shake at. All right. Um. So then, summon Princess. And then bring back Flamberge. And then use Wanted to search out via Bellstar, and then use uh, Oak as material to summon her. Oh, actually, no, wait. You have to go into like Ambo Whale or something first. We're going into sunlight. <laughs> nah, then then we'll we'll deal. Yeah, that's fine then. Just know that whatever you add back to hand with sunlight uh, cannot be summoned this turn. Sure. It's a good 
good ash or yeah. And then use the poplar to summon the Abel Star. So what you can do with Wanted is if you wait until you banish Original Sinful, you can get it back from Banish. As far as a little extra advantage. Oh, okay. Use original to search out a Snake Eyes and then use Wanted to get it back from the file. So you didn't really need the card at that point. I set the trap. Yep. Probably should have summoned that to the uh, Sunlight Wolf's zone so that. Oh, I get it the. Triggered. I suppose that's true. Yep. Uh, go in for some damage. And you could even set the Wanted as well. What does it do? Adds a Diabell Star to your hand. That's its uh, activation effect. Yep. Okay. And that's a quick effect, so you can. And then the trap can also discard from hand, so you can get one to your hand and then maintain field presence. Any reason to go into Appaloosa here? At this point, no. Too bad I didn't have a. Uh, so if you had the agave dragon, you have had the um, the spell that does the. Sending the back row, you would have been able to have IP in the back row right now instead of having to use his effect to, on uh, the hero. Just make sure you don't destroy DPE. Right. Uh, I mean, you can steal his DPE. Might as but, well, right? But. Only problem with that is if he destroys it, then he gets it back. In DPE target face down cards, does it have to be another hero? Mm -hmm. DPE can target any cards. And also he doesn't target. If I blow that up, nothing happens, right? Because he doesn't have anything in his grave. Correct. So you probably want to do that so that he can't like send something to the back row. <laughs> Although that might make Sunlight Wolf not work. Whatever. <laughs> I think it worked. Uh, Ash, I guess. Yeah. So you could use DPE to pop your face down Flamberge float into Poplar and Oak. That's cute. And then plus from there. Yeah, it's destroy one card. You have two Flamberge in hand? Wow, the... <laughs> I blow... Negate it. Oh, Negate it with Valor. So you have the Trap Negate, you have the BP Pop. He's probably going to try to ram into your, the, his DPE to get it to float. Sure. Or... Uh, you can just... Did he just scoop because he realized he picked the wrong one? <laughs> Maybe, or he just... He's like, fuck it. Alright, out of the deck. Okay. Alright, what am I missing? The field spell and... Oh, it's apparently not a Snake Eyes card. 
No, or Snake Eye. It might not be Snake Eyes. Only Flamberg and uh, Poplar are Snake temple Eyes. Temple of the Snake Eye. Yeah, Divine singular. Temple of the Snake Eye. Okay, so what, like one of those? Uh, yes. One of those, and then one of the big red round one. Sinful Spoils? Okay. Yes. Sweet. You didn't have Sinful Spoils in you the didn't deck? didn't have Sinful Spoils or the Field Spell. What the fuck did you do? Uh, do you have any... Are these the max amount of all the cards that you have? Yes. Okay. I mean, yeah, that's the, the two bonfires. Fantastic. One more card. What's that one right next to Ash between Diabell Star and Ash? I'm not. Uh... It's pretty, the star of the deck, basically. <laughs> I don't. I don't. I don't know what that. Uh, what that card is, Dave. Uh, why, why is it? What's it doing? In, what's it doing in this? Uh, in this deck. Forty-one's fine, Dave. You could go down to one oak if you really wanted to get down to forty. Nope. <laughs> See, Dave's back to bullying children. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, you didn't scoop right away, so... <laughs> Why is Gores there? Because Gores <laughs> is the best hand trap 2014. Or, sorry, 2024. <laughs> I mean, you know, that might actually wrong. be correct. Uh, no, that's, that's, even, that's even a little late. <laughs> Freudian slip. Hey, look, full combo. With a Valor, nice. I'm making some Nopales right now, chat. Oh, there you go. Some Napoles? Uh, draw phase, activate wanted. Or standby phase, activate wanted. You want to do it in draw phase, Dave. Oh, yeah? Why is that? It avoids Droll and Lockbird. Because you can't get Drolled in draw phase. He apparently doesn't have any interactions. Yet. All right, so special summon. Discard. Oh, boy. Uh, don't discard the Flamberge. You can either discard the Poplar. I would discard the Poplar. Because I'm about to get another one. Because she goes off. Yep. Key chain berries. That's cute. Yep. And then do the original sinful. Card I always search. <laughs> mm hmm. Yeah, original and then original on Poplar to summon out Ash. Search out Poplar. It's so free. Summon Poplar. Search out the field spell. This is where the second Flamberge is nice. Okay. Activate the field spell. Uh, place a card face up. Mm-hmm. Probably want to place Oak. This is where you would place the Flamberge, probably, but you want to summon the Flamberge. I understand. Uh, activate Ash, sending the Oak. I don't want a Link Reaver here? Um, you can, but Poplar already floated. Oh, gotcha. So you wouldn't get that right at this point. It's just kind of a waste of advantage, but... Um, so yeah, that and then Oak... Keeping Poplar on field to summon another oak. <clears throat> Oak's effect. Doesn't, doesn't how they have a lot of attack. Right. It doesn't matter because I think all of them will use their effects, but. Okay. Now you can use Oak's effect on any car of any of the ones to bring out Flamberge. Sweet. And then make IP. Don't activate Flamberge's effect yet. Make IP with Flamberge. Flamberge and Ash. Ash. Flamberge float into two more. This is the step I always get stripped up on is I gotta get rid of the dragon for a second. Before, yes, before you uh, use its effect. Going to the lady. Going to the lady. 
Yes. Bring back Flamberge. Put IP in the back row. Oop. Pick the right one, Dave. <laughs> At least this is the same combo every time. Yeah. Okay. Uh, and then you can go into Sunlight Wolf. Poplar. Did you normal summon? I didn't. So you have the option, if you wanted to, to normal summon Valor, get back something, go into Link Karibo, and then if you have Eat Soul in your extra deck, you could draw a card. Uh, I don't. Okay, but keep the Valor. Oh yeah, you do. You have Eat Soul. He's the top one, top red one. <clears throat> do I? Yeah. Go back to your extra deck. Oh, okay. So what do I do? Dark below Appaloosa is Heat Soul. So normal summon Valor. To <laughs> what's his face his thing? Yep. Okay. Activate this thing. Get back anything? Ash yep. probably. <clears throat> yeah. Uh, I guess Oak would have been fine too, because there's a lot of shit. Either one's fine. Special You Shogun. can send back the pop one next turn. Uh, Link Karibo? Link Karibo. Or you can go into Boral Savage if you really wanted to. Uh, that lose, I lose my board. interaction with the priest, though. Uh, this dude? No, you don't. Because Flambridge is going to summon IP, IP is going to summon something, and then Flambridge is going to float into target for Princess. I'm gonna trust you, I'm not paying attention. That's fine. Some this dude. Pay a thousand life points to draw a card. Okay, sure, whatever. And that is a quick effect on both turns, so you can do it on your opponent's turn as well. Cute. Should I do the other draw? No. I think you don't need it at this point, especially with the max C, and then you can banish Original Sinful. And then Banish wanted to get that out of the Banish pile back in your deck as a search target for Poplar. Because you have, both your Poplars are in the grave, so you want to make sure that those one of those gets back put back in the deck for your next turn. So in Ash. turn or set this thing? Oh, uh, you can set it. Because I gotta get moving. Yep. So you're fine. And then you can summon IP as soon as you want. Activate Heat Soul as well. Just remember that Promethean Princess has the Fire Lock. So you want to activate IP's summon effect before Promethean Princess. I understand. So with IP here, you could probably go into um, Appaloosa if you wanted to be a little bit preventative. Uh, with with the Flamberge, Diabell Star, and IP. Mm. Mm. So glad Ryan's here. Holy shit, it's ancient gear. Uh, no? No, you don't want to do it. You don't have to do it with him. You can keep him. Just the bottom. Because I kind of like his effect. <laughs> and then now that Dia Bellstar's gone to the grave on your opponent's turn, you can activate her to summon herself by pitching one of those ashes in hand. 
and uh, summon. What, just a bunch of shit? Oak and poplar, I guess. I don't know. Just because if you get oak and ash, then one of those can get poplar. So now, as soon as he special summons something, uh, send yeah. Search the trap card? Yeah, I guess so. It's not going to be any useful to you right now, but it's fine. Just activate all the effects. I don't know what they're doing. Uh, just say yes. So, yeah, he's going to summon something. Poplar's going to add yes. one of, Yeah. Poplar's going to add one of the spells. You can add the big red one. And then the bell star is gonna set the trap. Wish I had time. No. <laughs> <laughs> What's this big thing do? Mm -hmm. it, uh, simple spoils puts a card your opponent controls into the back row. Yeah, yeah. it pushes it back into the back For row. Or free. Yeah, it doesn't uh, have any other cost. That's neat. It just does that. It's one of the best interactions uh, we have currently. That's fine, whatever, I don't care. You also definitely should have summoned those guys in attack mode because the snake eye field spell is wetlands. Ah! For some reason. Run off chain, I guess, at this point. He's not gonna do anything. You went into battle phase? Even And you don't have any interactions, really? You need time, because... Well, Alright, nice. so activate um, original sinful spoils in the graveyard to banish itself. Sending back a poplar and search out ash. Or oak, or whatever you have left. Doesn't matter. Or you could just push his card into the back row and attack for game. Yeah, what do you think that... Uh... That's really... It doesn't matter, because you have the trap that negates it. Negates anything? Yeah. Yep. Any face-up card. So Maria is hot red. Yeah, activate the spell card from your hand, or get his card. I'm trying. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. So it's not, it's any card. So that's, that's neat. Very versatile. Come on. At least it's not lowering your timer. But I think you have enough, you definitely have enough to gain. But you don't have to do anything at this point, just attack. Well, doesn't the trap get rid of something? Um, it does. Do I care? No, apparently not. <laughs> no. Because <laughs> you technically have a wanted set, so you could just refill your hand. Mm. Ugh, I hate when I'm down on time like that. I mean, that's it's the same combo every time. So once you once you get that quick, then most of your time is just spent interacting with your opponent on their turn. Our turn, you mean? <laughs> uh, they are red. We just don't have the attack token. Okay, that's a good hand. 
Ja. Uh, Why do you keep opening Flambergs? You're one off Flambergs. Right. Okay, Ashbait? You let it ride. I would say Ash, search Poplar, Poplar, summon, get the field spell. Stop asking if I'd like to ash my own card. Right. No, I don't want to ash my own fucking card. <laughs> Maxi. Fuck. Well, now you can ash it. It's true. I'm still not used to that interaction. <laughs> what, Matt? Ashing a Maxi? Yes. Really? He's not used to his uh, deck working. I know, it's weird. One card starters. So yeah, search the field spell, and then you can make Link Karibo with Poplar. <clears throat> I should get Oak there, right? Yeah, dealer's choice. But it gets it in rotation. Mm -hmm. So probably should do Oak. Whatever I don't have. Yeah, I mean you can you get out next anyway. So here you're gonna wanna use Link Karibo to summon Oak from deck with Ash's effect. Why not one of the face downs or face ups? Those are next. I'm just gonna trust you. <laughs> Okay. Now Oak on one of the face-ups to get Flamberge. Okay. Mm. Here's the option, now that you have uh, the Bell Star, you could go into um, Formula Synchron if you wanted to. Oh. Mm-hmm. I don't have time. You're going to tell me to do it Fine. or not. <laughs> um, yeah, just do the same combo. So go into IP. <clears throat> we'll, we'll start with this one. We'll get this one down, and then we can, we can work in the other one as well. I should be putting these in attack mode. And then Princess. God, this is stressful. You're doing great. Oh, Flamberge. I, I hate this so much. <laughs> I can't tell you how much I hate clicking around like this. Pressures of a meta deck. Flamberge effects to put IP in the back row. It's like I individually know all of this. It's just, it's uh -huh. like... Trying yep. to remember it when I'm trying to not time out is awful. Yeah. <clears throat> uh. With Ash and Promethean Princess? Because I don't want to lose already, my dragon. You've already used Flamberge. Yep. Okay, and I'm going to summon this thing. Yep. Send a card to don't Grave. Worry, it only uh, gets used. Poplar. The one on field. Yep. Here I search the trap, I would assume. Yep. Right. Because I don't need this other thing. You do not. You could use it if you... No, you probably want the trap. I put this in, hand. <laughs> That's cheesy. Yep. Exactly. How's it feel to not be bleeding advantage? I guess I'm good, right? Yes. Yep. Pass turn. And then uh, summon IP whenever you get a chance. And then you have the option to either go into Appaloosa or Nightmare Unicorn. Great. 
interruption. Let's see what he's playing first. Oh, Sun Valon. Sun right. Avalon. Okay. So the funny thing about Sun Avalon is, uh, it's bad. If he gets going, it it can definitely do stuff. But yeah, Ash this. I can't. Oh, it's setting it. Oh no! Yes, I can. Yeah. Don't. No. 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 Don't when, Ash it. When, when's it? When's the interaction? Here, the I'm shrine. Not really... Shrine. The spell. The spell card. Okay. So you want the spell till, card? Wait till the spell card, Dave. Sewing. Yeah, you can go into Apo here with IP uh, Sunlight Wolf, and, uh, and that'll yeah, and that'll be helpful. So Ash, uh, Ash sewing. Okay. And then go into Apo. Because all of the rest of their extenders are monster effects. And if they special summon an extender, you can princess it. Leaving yeah. the Abel Star on board, but Apo with yeah, that's fine. Does not matter, Dave. And then no on that one, and then Flamberge for your last one. Flamberge. Because I need more attack power. It's just more interaction. And it stops mm -hmm. them from thrashering. And then blue and green. Summon blue and green. Trying. And then use uh, green to summon red. And you can search out Jet Synchron, I guess, if you want, with Ash. Because why not? Or you can do the... Uh, yeah, why not? Div Incarnate if you think that he's going to have a bunch of stuff. I don't think you don't have that in the deck, so... This goofy fucking board. Um, Poplar can search out whatever you want, I guess. I'm going to get this <clears> in here. <throat> I'm going to get that little... Yeah. I'm gonna get the red eye of Sauron. There you go. <laughs> it said one fast! So now you have the Promethean Princess engraved for any special summons. Yep. Yeah, he's. At this point, you could just go to battle phase and. Uh, even with losing Dia Bellstar, I think that's enough for game. Uh, not quite. Oh, yeah, barely. Because that has no attack power. Or you could go into Formula That's... Synchron. Can't attack it. Oh, really? Yeah, oh. no, but it doesn't stop you from attacking directly. It'll summon Sunvine uh, Thrasher. Uh... Oh, well. Correct. See, Sun Avalon would never allow you to attack the Mother Tree. Anyway. What do you got? Gores. <laughs> and, yeah, they gave that. Unfortunate that you, you attacked, attacked that last. Uh, hey, uh, so you can tribute uh, one of your monsters with Link Karibo. He doesn't have enough attack power. Uh, read your Snake Eye cards. That's all I can do. Uh, 
Uh, normal summon got Synchron. Okay. Formula? Yeah. And then put Flamberge in the background with um, Poplar. How do I move it out of there? With the field spell. Oh. So as soon as your opponent does anything, like normal summons a monster, you can summon Flamberge. And then... Um, And then go into Barone. Okay. You could go into Boral Savage at this point as well. I'm ending my turn because I don't have time. I don't know how to do that. <laughs> I'd have to think and I don't have time. I've got Master of Duel coming up my neck. Oh, I'm wearing a green shirt. It's true. Thank God Ryan is here, by the way, because trying to walk you through these combos, nightmare. Especially when you're, like, <laughs> wait, I think you're a little more behind. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I'm I'm trying to, like, say the next two steps ahead. And yeah, you can go into Barone as soon as you want. As soon as you get the opportunity to activate. Sunsea Twin well, no. is, a, is a crazy card for them. Don't to activate, the yeah. Win is what they summon off of sewing, by the way. Right. Gross. No. So blue searches, green adds the hand. Sure. At this point, you're just gaining advantage for no reason. But an empty advantage. <laughs> oh, it's not empty. Not yet, anyway. I guess the next time he special summons something, you can pop it with Promethean Princess. Sure can. Can I? Yep. Sure can. That's how Princess works. Unless it says you can't target it. That doesn't care. So I gotta blow something up on my field to blow something up on his field. Don't negate my own effect. How convenient you have a Link Karibo right there? That's such a good target to pop. You can't pop Link Karibo with Promethean Princess. Yeah, I know. Why did they not blow up? Sunvine Sewing. Yeah, it's, it's a replacement effect. Uh, yeah, we're gonna I think stop you that. can negate that with Barrow. Or I'm saving the Barone negate. Yeah, because she's weak at this point. So the model's a user. Okay, we won. <laughs> yeah. Like I said, all of their extension from then on out was in the form of a. Uh... And you can push one of their cards to the back row. With. Oh, With that thing I got. On. That thing I got. With the eye of Sauron. You pop the back spell. row. Push something into the back row. Uh, when this card is out, if you control a Link 4 or he does not. Does not. I don't care. Nope. That's bait. Alright. Uh, sure, we use the eye of Sauron. Sewing will protect. Put that thing in the back. Uh, enter battle phase? I don't know. Yeah. I think so. 
<clears throat> you still have your own negations. Swing a link rebo. <laughs> <laughs> So the the earlier like Boral Savage play would have been to summon Dia Bellstar to get original sinful and then use original sinful to summon out Jet Synchron. And then you have I don't remember the Dia state, Bellstar but, okay. as a seven and Jet Synchron's the one. And then if you have Link Karibo in the graveyard, you can go Boral Savage. Gotcha. That one really does require having uh, Snake Eyes Ash and Dia Bellstar in hand at the beginning. It's a little bit more of a complicated play line, but... Hmm. I've also seen people play things like Sprite Elf to get back your Formula Synchron. Sprite Elf is bad, actually. How do you summon I'm not in saying this it was step. good. I'm saying I've seen people use that. because you go You go IP with anything to make it. It's it's going okay, uh, Pib lover. Do you like Mr. Pib? Is that? I fucking love Mr. Pib. It's the best soda. All right, I guess like we're root beer, of course. I guess we're going bonfire. Yeah. Feels kind of ash. Your feels kind of weak. I the bone. Literally nothing can touch root beer, so. Except vanilla ice cream. No. You're not a float man. Nope. Ruins the balance of the root beer. If I got a cheap root beer, sure, I'll have a float, but... Can't get the good stuff in there. Wish this thing would, like, listen to me when I'm clicking. Oh... Uh, sure. So here you can go into Link Creepo, the Poplar, and then use the field spell to get put Flamberge in the... Actually, don't put Flamberge because you need the second ones in the deck. The field spell will put something else then. Oak. I guess. For another name. Sure. Doesn't really matter but ash and link rebo going to oak oak summons back ash and then oh that's Oak's right that's right that's right this is the fuck. yep because it's cheesy and you basically replace with what you just lost yes And then you use, use Oak's, Oak's effect. effect. Yep, I'm one of the back row. Probably Poplar. This gets your dragon. It gets your dragon. And then, without using the dragon's effect, go into IP. Uh, or here you could go into, you could original send full out the Jet Synchron. Okay. I don't. Yeah, yeah, do that. Try that. Let's try it. Using the the back row, bring out Jet, and then okay. use that to go into Formula. Okay. Sweet. And then here's the fun part: use those two to go into IP Masquerina. Okay. This is where the fun begins. This is don't go into Barone, go into Ivy Mascarena. That's weird. Mm hmm. Okay. Float with Flamberge. <sighs> and then go into Prometheus Princess, summon back Flamberge. Special summon the princess with IP Mascarena. Yep. 
and just anything. Yep. yep. Okay. <laughs> Uh, nope. The dragon. Get the dragon. Okay. And then put Formula Synchron in the back row with the dragon. Interesting. Okay. And then go into Sunlight Wolf, I guess. And then you can summon uh, the Star by pitching Sauron. Can I get it back? Yeah. I guess I could. There's also an argument for Maxi, right? There's an argument for Maxi. It it does telegraph that you have another one. I suppose that's true. And if you wanted to get the uh, Eye of Sauron back, you would go for Wanted here, or you can go for the Interaction. Uh, probably Oak back to hand. If you're looking for a target. I think the Trap is probably fine. Wanted will get you back the Eye of Sauron. I understand. But you uh... can get Wanted back. If, if you use the Trap... You would send Dia Bellstar. Dia Bellstar would then be sent on your opponent's turn. You would then be able to set Wanted for your turn to get back the, the spell anyway. Um, so on your first opportunity, summon the Formula Synchron and go into Brown. Standby. Activate Maxi. <laughs> You've become phone. what you have sworn to destroy, Dave. He's just figuring out how to destroy it from the inside. This is a recon mission. Um, and then when you go into Barone, Flanbird will float into Oak and Ash, and then Oak will summon Poplar. Poplar will search. Barone? You... Yep. And gives you ammunition for Princess. Float into... Blue and green. Because that will search, and this will, will search, summon? And then that will summon Poplar, and then Poplar will search. Target Poplar, I guess. Mm -hmm. Keep Jet Sinker on the grave. Uh, Oak also gets stuffed and banished, so when Jet Synchron when yeah, when Jet Synchron banishes itself after using its effect, you can just get it back. <laughs> I can't even summon. Probably Ash then, right? Doesn't matter. And then you could even shotgun the Link Karibo if you really wanted to to protect from battle. Because yeah, Link Karibo uh, with a decreasing in power Appaloosa is, is fun. Oh, double summon. Why are you beating up children? But yeah, do Poplar and then use Poplar's effect to put Flamberg in the uh, He's back row. He's playing Edison Gemini B. <laughs> I mean, hey. This is an Edison deck. It's also prohibitively expensive. Gets around that Maxi, though. Because that's yeah. two normal summons. From <laughs> Maxi and Princess. 
This, uh... How he prefers this to playing Paleo Frog. He fucking hates that he didn't Gemini summon that. He no, did. it's he a normal it's summon a choice. I think it's a Dude. bot. Because it's not Pib doing lover. anything. Pib lover, I need you to understand. Dave fucking hates combo decks like this. <laughs> they make me so this anxious. Is, this is the worst type of deck for Dave to play, and also he hates this style of deck. Which is funny, because I don't hate every combo deck. I just... Uh, sure? There's been a couple I've liked. I'm not sure what it was. Cosmo was one. I liked Cosmo. I think because I just liked the cards. Totally a bot. It is a bot. It's just crashing into my stuff. Yeah. Dave hates this style of deck specifically. That's fine, though. But, and then if your opponent, at this point, if your opponent did anything like normal summon another card, you could have summoned Flamberge back with the field spell. I'm not listening to that. <laughs> no, the field spell can also grab Flamberge from where it is. Understand. But at this point, you're free to move about the cabin. Right? Because I can just win? What's this face down, I wonder? Nothing. <laughs> Swing of memories. <laughs> this is legitimately an Edison deck. Is it like one of the starter decks or something? No. Why is a bot playing that then? Pro they probably just threw it on because it was the deck they had on. But yeah, that was an Edison deck. Uh, so yeah, the idea with this with this deck is go through all your cards, dump the the link one, two, and three to the graveyard, and kind of set up for next turn. Does that make sense? Maybe. Oh yeah, like we got reloads, swing of memories, lightning vortex, blazewing butterfly. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, this is this is literally like an Edison deck. It doesn't have the the Gemini beat stuff. Oh, Gemini farm. I'm pretty sure there's like a thing for Gemini summoning a certain amount of times, right? Oh, that's funny. Oh, they yeah. set up a bot to do it incorrectly. Yeah. <laughs> what is it? I got to show you this uh, ridiculous loss I had. <laughs> <laughs> oh, please. While you're watching replays, do you want to see the funniest FTK on Earth? Maybe. I don't think Sunny and FTK really go together much. So, like, are you I'm... familiar with Tenzin Yanagi? <laughs> no. So here uh, I'm. Airbender. Airbender. <laughs> so I don't know what I'm doing. So please ignore mm -hmm. the, the probable misplays I'm making with this deck at the moment. Yep. Um. But like, so the Sash Blossom kind of hurt. Sure. What I get here. So that was a pretty lousy opening play. So I don't know what this guy's. He goes into like Dream Shark? Why is Flamberge like tied to your hand, Dave? I don't know. It's obnoxious. So he it goes into obnoxious. Bahamut and then he just yeah, starts stacking. Tell, right? Yeah, stacking shit on this thing. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> it's freaking nice. wild. It just like keeps slapping shit on it. It's fine. Don't even worry about it. But wait, there's more. No, <laughs> but wait, there's this more. Is this is the this is the armored exceed shark deck. It's like 100% a new. Slap something else on it. Boom. And then he just and he OTKs me. Nice. The armor exceed cards are actually cards that I think you would really like, Dave. I was like, oh man, I want to play that. That was, <laughs> that was cool. Uh, yeah, no, it's it's exactly the kind of deck I think you would like. Just keep it's a very cool shit. variant of sharks that we that we recently got. Um, like, do you have a fun replay? Yeah, it's on my profile, Dave. So I can find you. How's... Should be the only one. There you are. Smile. Can we, can we talk about how clunky it is to like do yes. anything? <laughs> do anything with replays 
You're out of replay space. Okay, let me back out of literally every menu. Go three menus deep to my replays. Delete a few. Go five menus back. <laughs> yeah. All right, so what are we playing here? Are you here? familiar with Tenzin Yanagi from Yu-Gi-Oh! 5Ds? No. Oh, is he that? No, but my he... treasures! He plays this weird, like, Kingdom of the Crystal the Skull deck, deck, right? deck! Right? Yeah. The illegal forbidden treasures. Stonehenge. You're gonna want to speed this up a bit, Dave. Because it's probably a wombo combo. It's a FTK. You, you got some Kawaki Mirus. You got some Emancipators. Ad Emancipators. You got some Emancipated Miners. <laughs> I'M TIRED OF THIS PLACE! I have any of that. Not an emaciated, emancipated. <laughs> emaciated miner? Yeah, you have some... <laughs> child mine workers? I don't know, what do you... Uh, a grown man can be emaciated. It's true, but, like, starving children's not a, not funny, Ryan. <laughs> Hashtag yeah, nothing. There's, like, food, not everyone gets it. LOL. Not bad. Ridiculous. The Triangle Zeros are, is a goofy card. Yeah, and then you chain Totem Bird in your graveyard, which doubles all the damage that you take. Okay, back to playing this nonsense. Yes. Can we resolve Gores once? Just No. You have no, no way of searching it. You have... One I in mean, the deck. If you, if you name it Flamberg's Dragon, maybe your deck will put it in your hand. Uh... <laughs> Uh, just keep opening so this far is, I think Dave's undefeated. Yes. I am. Not through his work, technically. Okay. Which we is are, something we, collective, collective we on the stream. Hey, look, I didn't I, open Flamberg's Dragon. Thank fucking God. Me backseat piloting. But I got a second copy of Ash, so I had a dead card anyway. Hey, look, full combo. Discard two dragons. You know what? We're going to just... Shotgun Maxi. Yeah, because he's if he searches out alternates, then you can just you play it. Won't, yeah, you won't have a window Pl to chain. Yeah. Plus, I'm 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 cosplaying as another Blue Eyes player, so yes. <laughs> he's probably gonna scoop as soon as you summon Ash, unless he has like interaction. Technically, Ryan is undefeated. <laughs> Rue. Hashtag Real. Better Dave, right? One of us has to know how to meta. Right? I know how to meta, just not this deck, because it priced me out of the format because of how fucking expensive I am deck is. really enjoying not Another being Ash. Priced nice. Out of good decks. Yeah, Master Duel is cool like that. Anyway, like, so I haven't I gotten really... a single copy of Diabell Star. Well, I really enjoyed um, playing full power tier elements. Like, that was, I had a ton of fun. Reaching, I think I went uh, master rank with tier limits. Tier is very cool. Uh, Sounds like contrary this is. To what what's my out to that fun. stupid chaos max dragon, by the way? Yeah, he actually had a blue eyes engraved to proc the effect. He did. Contrary to what a lot of uh, scrubs think, uh, tier was very cool. Very expensive. Uh, the problem with tier was uh, the Ashizu cards. Yeah, I mean, even then, I found the Ashizu cards very interactive. And oh, there's really Flamberg. Just... The... <laughs> <Don't... laughs> right, uh, guess... You could try the Raigeki here. Just to... If he's got Jet Dragon... Oh, well. He's got Jet Jaguar. Yep. Okay, anyway. Uh, normal Summon Snake Eyes Ash. Yeah. Activate the effect. Yeah. Search Poplar. <clears throat> yeah. Poplar's effect. Yeah. Summon Poplar. Poplar's effect. Search the field spell. Because you want to go for damage for the FTK here? Sure. Activate the field spell. Put, I don't know. Your second copy of Flamberg's Dragon. Uh, do I want to put my Oak here? 
Mm, something from hand. Something from hand. Extra copy of Ash. Special summon Link Karibo. <clears throat> Put it over there. Activate that stupid poplar for the third time this turn. All Put three it. of its effects. Put it in the fucking back row. You got it. Activate Ash's effect. Yeah. Get rid of this thing. No. Summon my stupid dragon. That's in your hand for some reason. <laughs> Without fail. Um. Oh, should oh, I? should have been. Nah, that should have been out there. That's all right. Okay, so I fucked up. That's fine. Do wanted. Search out Dia Bellstar. Summon Dia Bellstar. Got this thing. Using one of your back rows. Okay, now I see why it... Okay. Sure. I guess I'll grab... Grab original? Okay. Original uh... on Ash? Sure. I think that's from hand, too. So summon the oak. Hmm. <clears throat> You know what's a good show? Oak's effect. Doesn't really matter. That's right, no. chat. X Man 97. That show is so very At this good. point, I could just swing for game? Yes. I'm going to do that. I'm not going to yep. BM this kid. But that's, that's why I said the field spell is important for the Yoshi K. Because, yeah, at this point. You could continue to combo off, but you don't need to. I'm not gonna BM this kid. <laughs> That's just more opportunities for you to make mistakes. True. So yeah, the Diabell Star searching out original sinful spoils is kind of your "Oops, I made a mistake." Get out of jail free card. It's, it's really obnoxious to deck cast something like that. <laughs> yeah, if uh, if you haven't started watching X Men '97 chat, you should. So I started watching X Men, and I couldn't like get through general? the first episode. Is it boring? Of the original? Of the original. Yeah, no, it's bad. Mm -hmm. Uh, you should just watch X Men '97, unless you, you really that? want that. Unless you really want that extra context, you don't need it. What video I can watch for context? Just watch the opening I mean, don't need it. crawl. Do I, do I have enough open. context just by osmosis because I know everything about the X-Men already? Yes. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> okay. This is a weird uh, hand. I'm not going to spoil what happens, uh, but the latest episode was so good, it sent Magneto back to the Holocaust. Oh. That could have. Normal yeah. summon Poplar. Okay. Activate his effect. Yeah. Original. Ooh. It's a good thing we got this. Yeah. That he might scoop right now. That's a big possibility. So I'm going for... The original sinful you, you spoils. You want to summon Ash from the deck. Which is what this thing does. Yep. It's crazy. You can target it's crazy Poplar. this is searched by two cards of a different archetype. Yep. Okay. Special summon. Why this, they work together. This thing. It's like it was by design or something, right? <laughs> <laughs> something, something lore. So then you probably want to... You could search out Jet Synchron here if you wanted to, or you could just search out another Poplar and summon it. We'll go on that. Okay. Field presence. Okay. So then probably want to go into Oak 
here. I don't need to go into Link Rebo because I've already used the back row, right? Yeah. Okay. So it doesn't... I mean, I could, but it, do, it doesn't... Could. I'm actually going to use the one in the back row. <sighs> I don't think it matters. Not particularly. Because I'm just going to send these two to grave. Mm-hmm. Get that stupid dragon out of my hand. <laughs> it's it's, actually, it's hand. actually not in my hand for once. Okay. I guess I'm gonna go into the field spell here. Yeah, why not? Uh, an so the field spell can summon something from the back row. So if you grab oak, you can kind of like daisy chain a little bit, which is neat. All right. No. Well, you know. Know that for next time. Sure. Or an IP Mascarena with her boobies. Hey, Mascarena. Summon a bunch of shit from the graveyard. IP Mascarena is gay. <laughs> According to you, every female monster is gay. Uh, well, most of the ones that have come out in recent times are. Yes. Like. Like. The live twins, they're dating. <laughs> the, Get my the Exo back. sisters, they're dating. IP is dating SP. She's dating her motorcycle. No, she is. She does. She, she just Akira slides everywhere. <laughs> yes, she's in a relationship with Force Just Akira slides everywhere. <laughs> It's hard to get around when you're constantly a Kira sliding. <laughs> um, yeah. And then yeah, put even, IP in the back row. Even Dia Bellstar has recently been revealed to be gay. Well, she's like a witch, right? Like, they're all kind of... Okay, but, so, do you know what the original <laughs> sin is in the original Sinful Spoils? Uh, eating the apple? Yes, from the Garden of Eden. Right. Which these two women ate Pastor? together in the Pastor. Garden of Eden. In the Garden of Eden, honey. Like they're they're just writing it. They they are just writing it. It's like when Adam you was could in preemptively Storm, go to was here it Storm or Ragnarok or name that stupid show. What was that? What's that anime on Netflix? Oh, Seven Deadly Sins? No, the other one. Uh, is that the, the Isekai video game one? No, it's like Storm of Ragnarok, which sounds like a Yu-Gi-Oh! fucking... Record of uh, Ragnarok. Ragnarok. Storm of Ragnarok is a Yu-Gi-Oh! <laughs> Record of Ragnarok. Yeah. Real Delicious in Dungeon! I'm actually watching that right now. I love Delicious in Dungeon. I have, uh, every week I have done a new recipe. So just just be careful uh, what you add back to hand, because you won't be able to summon that this turn. We are your good spell. Yeah, he valanced all over you. This is actually a really funny matchup. Because the valance also put themselves in the back row as mm -hmm. continuous spells. Yeah, I don't know that I would have done anything with the Sunlight Wolf, honestly. It's fine. Trust. His connection failed. He probably misplayed. Sure. And we got a sandstone for our for our troubles. Why did he even bother giving us those things? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> it's like a bunch of like Legend of Blue Eyes White Dragon vanillas that are in the drop know. pool. <laughs> <laughs> like who cares? If I'm not getting like the Drek, I don't give a shit. Where's my Drek, Konami? Release the unlock the Drek. 
Unlock the drag. <laughs> <laughs> why do why don't we have the drag? What what's up with that? Hey, look, full combo. Hey Ryan, did you change your uh, settings? Did I change my settings? Yeah, you all you all of a sudden got tinny. No. Is it still tinny? Yeah, it's not like you're using an entirely different mic. Oh, fudge! Hey, it didn't matter! Never punished! Let's go! <laughs> I misclicked, but it didn't matter. How about now? Sound better? Sounds That sounds more correct. Okay. What happened? I turned on my DualSense controller and it automatically switched. Nice. Yeah. Give us bat. <laughs> just... I got some. Now that now that you got the deck figured out, I got some some grinding I need to do. Nice. Where's my Yamatono Dragon Scroll? Yamate Yugi. Yamate Yugi. The Yamate Dragon Scroll. <laughs> Yamate Kudasai Dragon Scroll. Oh, uh, we playing against Yamate. We're playing against fucking stun. Probably. Wow, he drew Maxi. Nice. All right, well we're gonna bonfire, bonfire scoop. Okay. Come on, bonfire scoop. Bonfire Poplar? Ooh, Royal Rare Max C. How do you want to do the deal with that? Too bad I don't have my Royal Rare uh, uh, called by the grave. I drew the other one. That's big. So you probably should have Ash Blossomed that one. Right, so my own Max C wouldn't be dead. Well, and then, because you could, if he has, if he has Max C... Then you could have stopped his maxi. That's uh, fine. I mean, his ash blossom. That's what I meant. Yeah. And then you could just get ash blossom back with the uh, sunlight wolf later. It's a labyrinth. Ugh. Ooh. Fine. Well, well you can ash blossom that. <laughs> ash blossom that. <laughs> <laughs> It's not even worth the draws. LOL. <laughs> Welcome, Labyrinth 2. Now you can, uh, Maxi. Well, no, it's already been... Oh. Uh, right? Yeah, you, uh, you called by it. Called by it. Uh, what was I doing? Okay. <laughs> 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 that's like a fucking really deep into a chain, like... Uh-huh. Wait, that's why can't... Labyrinth. Did I miss timing? Still his turn. Uh, good cards don't miss timing, Dave. Oh, it's asking does he want to use that stupid thing. I was like, there's no way that Poplar, like, fails to resolve timing. here. timing, no. Good cards don't miss timing. Good cards don't miss timing, you're like... What is this, Yang Zing? Fuck. <laughs> Dupe Frog. I hate that so much. They did Pet in the Dark Clown dirty with that. Uh huh. He would have been like perfect Link fodder. Oh, yeah. But instead, he's terrible. <laughs> <laughs> they could just get rid of it. I hate that. That is one of the biggest annoyances with. It logically card makes sense if you break down it, the logic, yeah. or the the literal logic of the card, but sure, it's stupid. Very stupid. Just like fucking labyrinth. Oh my god. Mm-hmm. Talk about our turn. You know, I really shouldn't be complaining. I'm 
my deck is just as interactive, just in a different way, but... People complain about, tur like, games not lasting so many turns, but honestly, it's, it's, you know, three times, five times as many mini turns throughout one turn, because everybody can play all the time. So you're yeah, not just sitting a... there necessarily waiting for your opponent. Uh, in theory, at least. Right. <laughs> if your deck's not very interactive on your opponent's turn, then yeah, you're sitting there watching your opponent play, and that's pretty lousy. Yeah, that's that's about as boring as it gets. Uh, sure. Cool. Oh, did I screw something up? No, I didn't. I'm just a turn behind. Oh, you're good. I'm a... Why do I send? Do you want to search? Do you want to summon uh, Oak with Link Karibo? Why do I want to send Link Karibo here instead of one of the back rows? I never, I never understood this. Because it's. It can summon itself from the graveyard to dodge uh, targeted effects. I mean, I know it'll eventually go to grave anyway. I'm just... as Why do I do it at that point in time, I guess, is my question. That doesn't really much matter. Um, for the, the... I think the... It's best practice in the sense of if you wanted to go for the Boral Savage play, you would have a target in Grave. Also, the neat thing about Boral Savage is it still gets its tokens, or it gets its, um, its negates, even if it doesn't have uh, Link Karibo actively attached to it. So you can then use uh, Link Karibo attached to Boral Savage as more like summon material. I gotta get over 2100, and this is obnoxious. <laughs> um, I mean, you're gonna get a 3000 monster in a sack here. Do I remember my combo? No. I mean, I just spent hours with Edo Pro and just kept doing this, so. One day I'll go into the other thing. One day. But it is not this day. It's not this day. I mean, that's for the the um, mirror match. Specifically. So you could, you could send his thing to the back row if you wanted to. Yeah, why not? That's, it's that. Or, or some free damage. And I guess technically you probably should have waited to go into Sunlight Wolf. So you would have been able to do damage first. Oh, yeah, because I would have had more guys on board. Mm -hmm. Fair enough. Would I have won? Uh, would have been 27. No, it would have been like no. 16 short or something. Yeah. Okay, at least I can, I can live with that. Uh, Fernando. I think Maxi is still negated, right? It is. It's a bummer. Now you can either grab his card or you can grab your card. His card's you probably wanna... dead, so I'm gonna I think leave you it there. You want to grab? Uh, probably. Sh yeah. Only the Dragon Warrior can do it. Uh, if you summon something to Sunlight Wolves, I think you can get your Ash back. Okay. That's good. That's a very good point. Yes, I can. Because you're not summoning it, so you can use its effect. No. Add to my hand. I want to get this thing. Uh, yeah, I want my Ash Blossom. That's so cheesy. <laughs> and we're going to do this. Just in case. 
I imagine sunlight's once per turn. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it is. I'm gonna get the other poplar. LOL. <laughs> and you can summon it. You can summon something that you put there with the field spell. Once he does something? Once he does something. Wait, Labyrinth Labyrinth. Labyrinth Labyrinth? Something like that. Labby Labby? Labyrinth yes. Labyrinth? Oh, what the fuck? Fucking lava golem. What a cheese ball. If only your card floated. Take it, monster. <laughs> 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 Fuck you. I got rid of my dragon. I like my dragon. He's kind of cool. He is kind of cool. He's like, if Sauron was like, you know what? Dragons are cool. I'm going to be a dragon. Here, hold this. I'm fire. <laughs> I'm dead. I am dead. <laughs> <laughs> Sauron moseys up to the lonely mountain and says, Yo, I you like gold. Want to hold this ring for me? <laughs> That'd probably be bad. What if Smaug had, Smaug the, one ring? had the ring? <laughs> He'd probably just burn it. That'll just be, a, you know, Ate it. a big invisible dragon. It's probably... I'm going to shock on the Maxi because I don't know what the fuck that card is. Holy uh, shit. Is that a dream? I don't either. <laughs> oh, he ashed it. What okay. is it? Guess he needed it. Nem Nemorilia. Nemorilia. Oh, so this Sweet part. Sweet dreams this, are this deck, made of uh, these. I can't really, I can't really explain what this deck does. I'm sorry. Uh, Im so imagine if Eater of Millions was an archetype, and it banished all your cards face down. Okay, uh, got some sleeping little yeah. girl. Yeah. Mhm. Mm yeah. So read her monster effect. No. <laughs> <laughs> I don't you, wanna. You need to. It's the entire deck. Okay. Gross. So she's like asleep, and all these weird desserts are coming to life into monsters. Is that is that the? They're all her dreams. Why was she dreaming about this thing? This thing's a nightmare. So is that. <laughs> <laughs> They're just getting They're worse. Defending her eepiness. <laughs> They're getting worse. Look at this. She's hungry. Uh. Yeah. No. I feel you like you didn't read her. Did you? Yeah, I did. Mm -hmm. What does she do? She summons herself, but she must be faced off from the deck. Uh huh. What is the rest of that effect text? If for all a banished crap, I lose cards. Uh-huh. How does she summon herself? I don't know. I missed that part. <laughs> We're just going to beer this person anyway. <laughs> Mound to the bound creator. I guess these are level 10s. Oh, uh, yeah. And that wasn't summon enough to do Nibiru. Mm -hmm. Right. Okay. Uh, bonfire. They look bonfire. They look full combo. Probably want to grab Poplar here. Whoa. Oh, yep. really? Why? Poplar summons himself. Free advantage. Without a normal summon. Oh yeah, because it would get itself off. Yes, it does get itself yeah. off, Dave. It's important. You've just described every meta duck. It's important to uh, practice self-love sometimes. The beacon is lit! Snake Eyes calls for aid. Poplar is good at getting itself off. All three of its effects. It's not even like a joke. <laughs> I mean, it's a joke because, I mean, like, 
<laughs> he he touched pee pee lol but like right <laughs> <laughs> like it's like literally it's a joke but uh huh it's the funny part this is so goofy what has he got Couldn't tell you. He's he's waiting for something. Mm -hmm. It's making me nervous because he's like mm -hmm. he's like passing. Uh, That's the other. Uh, he, he's passing priority to me about, <laughs> about playing a meta deck. Is people know your deck better than you? He keeps passing priority. He's waiting for a choke point. Uh, this would be the choke point. Is summoning Flamberge. Right? It's like not in my hand, so... Alright, I got my big cool dragon out. My spooky, cool. my spooky dragon. Spooky dragon. Okay. Uh... So Try to float into. Okay, well now we're good. Yeah. Now, now things happen. Maybe he just doesn't know how my deck works, so he's just waiting to see what the end board is. Maybe. Unless he's got like a graveyard negate, called by type job. He's got one. I don't know what those monsters do. Mound of the Bound just protects from targeting, right? I think so. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Three thousand is a big number. Or no targeting. Click the monsters and find out what the monsters do. That oh. takes time, and time is not a luxury that we have. <laughs> I will click them in a minute. <laughs> uh, <laughs> sure. I'm going into Promethean Princess here. Yep. I'm gonna get my dragon back. This is also a decent choke point. Oh, I think he's just... What? No. <laughs> Targeted or destroyed. Target one face up monster on the field. Or in either graveyard. Okay, so that doesn't really help me right now. Nope. Sunlight to get rid of this stupid thing. Cool. Zelantis isn't good, Abdullah. I mean, it could be kind of useful here. Uh, no. You could spin back the field spell. With what? Uh, unicorn. Unicorn. So oh. you could put you could put IP uh, back row. I see what you're saying. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Abdullah. And then uh, do it on Zealantis, your opponent's turn. Zealantis is bad until we get the transphobe OTK. Once we get the transphobe OTK, we're good. I'm just gonna assume I can kill this. Let's see what happens. Yeah, and you know what card is worse than Zealantis? And blow whale. No, I can't. Okay. But that's okay. He lost a card to do that. That's good. Mm, is it? I feel like it. That's what I just said, Kenneth and Michael. I just Brothers said, is... once we get the transphobe line. Turn into. Turn this on? <clears throat> Ooh. That is but to return it to the hand during the end phase. So he's just basically searching a a guy. Yep. In before he hits me with like goose stuff. And then off. turning <laughs> his uh, sleepy girl on. Uh, it is the same thing, uh, Michael. Uh, do you know what the uh, transfer well. OTK involves? It involves raging phoenix. 
It's required. It's it's the and Transfer you can OTK get Sunlight Wolf. That's is pretty the funny. OTK line that goes through Raging Phoenix Zealantis. Add to my hand probably this thing. Even though Ash. I, even though I already got one. Add what you don't have. True. I I do not know why you would uh, play Zealantis uh, outside of the transpho OTK. Does it out this board? <laughs> Kinda. Hey, look, I can uh, get two things. Because he was a dum dum. Okay, Abdullah, that I have just been saying, and Michael and Kenneth have been saying, that it is it is the line that goes through Raging Phoenix with Zealantis. I think I think the part that you're leaving out, weirdly enough, is uh, the fact that we don't have Raging Phoenix and Master Duel yet. That's what I've said. No, I think you uh, just aren't saying that part. That I, people I are said, clearly I said, not. When we get Raging Phoenix, well, you know, when they, we they get the line for the Transphobe OTK in Master Duel. In Master Duel. Yes. Yes. But Zealantis is still the worst card of that. It's a bad card, guys. You it don't need its... Whale! Whale is terrible! Whale is... The... Whale is a whale... terrible card. So, Whale is better in this sense? I guess you could go into... In this sense, because you could... Uh, have a little bit more interaction if you didn't want to go fully into Decode Heat Soul. I, I'm screaming right now. No, Lalo. You do not know how this works. Please read the cards that you are referring to. I mean, you could probably preemptively Apo here so that his monster effects don't don't work. And then you have Link Karibo to protect a low attack Apo. Right? Yeah. No. <clears throat> Yes. So, the line that goes through Raging Phoenix goes through, triggers Promethean Princess via Zealantis to pop your opponent's cards and assemble lethal. An Earthbound Immortal? <clears throat> there may be an OTK that is possible through retriggering Princess, but it is not an OTK line. It is you having an established board and then Zealantising to trigger Princess. The entire combo is predicated upon Raging Phoenix. Because you use Raging Phoenix to link up from Prometheus, go into your Zealantis, trigger the Promethean Princess, revive, and then you use Princess to revive the Raging Phoenix. Ooh, man, that was a lot of cards. Eater millions. Yeah! Now he's going to banish your whole field. I am begging you, chat, to understand the difference between an OTK, where you kill your opponent with an established board, and an OTK line. He One of those is a combo, five. and the other is killing your opponent on turn three. What's your stat line? Nothing. <laughs> You could try popping the eater. I don't know if that matters. That's the only target you have. It's not a bad combo. Or not a bad play right now. Because that thing's kind of obnoxious at the moment. <clears throat>
Yes, Michael. I'm and Michael. I'm honestly, to... if he summons enough, Nibiru. Michael, I'm trying to simplify it for the yeah. people in chat who don't read. So all of them. Yes, the only one who knows. <laughs> the only one who knows what I'm talking about is Michael. And maybe let it Kenneth. go. Get some use out of this Appaloosa at least. There you go. Does he got something? It's literally all of us. You just pointed to all of us. This is like some epic, trust my opponent's monsters don't do anything energy, they right? They don't. <laughs> they don't. Because I'm like, they it's haven't done anything for a few... just the little girl. I know, right? Oh, that's funny. I would have done that before, but... <laughs> but yes, uh, Ambla Whale is a bad card. The reason that Ambla Whale is played is because it is currently the only Link 4 fire There's monster. Kaka Poopa Poopoo or whatever. Koko Paka Poo? Oh no, that's uh, that's Kusilu. That's not Koko Paka Poo. You you got me excited thinking we were gonna see Coco Pacapu. No, if only if only Link Ribo didn't. Does it target? No, it just no. attacks directly. Link Ribo doesn't target, so you could just zero out his attack. I could. Why didn't you? Because I was trying to see what it would do. I was. Because I wouldn't kill it in return. Okay, I need, uh... Bring back your Flamberge. Okay. I can't target either of those monsters. So you're gonna have to go into Unicorn at some point here and get rid of his field spell. But you have to go into a fire first. Oh, we quit. <laughs> Cause I, I could go Jet Synchron I was trying to get the Barone. Well, you would have had to get rid of Promethean Princess first. Correct. I think there were he, ways. You had lots of ways. I did. I think he got frustrated when I when I resummoned the drag. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I think maybe he should uh, play a play a better deck. I don't know. It was interesting. It certainly was interesting. It did a it lot of non. It did a lot of nonsense for me to win anyway. Yeah. Actually, that's a good point. Marilia. Do you have White Woman Jump Scare? No. You don't have the card? No. Really? I mean, I'm pretty sure I do not. Mm. Underworld Goddess of the Closed World. Underworld Goddess of the Underworld. Surprise! All right, so Bonfire. Yeah. I'm going to get Poplar this time. Poplar. Poplar's effect. Super cute. Droll unlock. Gross. Okay. That's okay. So what happens when you get Droll unlocked? Nothing? Uh, <laughs> you lose? You could go into... You don't add cards anymore. Yeah. Go into... Link Karibo here. Hey, uh, do you know what Diabell Star does? It doesn't add to hand, so... <laughs> yeah. Uh, Poplar's effect, to set it, Add uh, activate Diabell Stars to send Poplar. That gets me two guys. And uh, Diabell Star does this funny thing where it... Uh, where it uh, sets the card. Uh, I don't, do you get the trap here, maybe? Um. Oh. Because. Okay. Doesn't matter. No, it's fine. Uh, now you can normal summon Oak to summon Poplar from the grave. Which gets you Flamberge. Which gets I you Flamberge. I feel like this guy's annoyed. 
at this point, because I had everything to get through that. Activate Oak. I probably want to get rid of Link Karibo here, right? I think so. Yeah. <laughs> oh no, anyway. Literally, oh no, anyway. That's without searching a card, yep. technically speaking. <laughs> you search one card. Uh, uh, so here you can go into IP. Yeah, so uh, just, a, just a quick tip for those in chat. Um, Droll sucks right now. I mean, it was annoying, I guess. Droll does basically nothing against pure Snake Eye. It only really affects Fire King Snake Eye if they didn't open their search target. Why hand trap no stop turn? Game bug. And then Game yeah, leave. Bug. Try to leave Diabell Star on board, I guess, until because it might go away. If it goes, if it goes to the grave on your opponent's turn, it gets effects. Understand. Wow, that really well, didn't inhibit me at all. No <laughs> I just had to do it. I just had to do it this in a different order. Yep. That's very funny. That's the part where knowing the deck and how it works is is definitely the big part. So, I think you're you're pretty much. Pretty much there. You're, you're actually in kind of a weirdly better position. Um, Isn't this deck bullshit? Yes, this is stupid. <laughs> Just like, wait it didn't matter. Fire King part. Just wait until we get the Fire King part. And, and then you can mix it with things game. like Rescue Ace. Oh, we can mix it with things like Rescue Ace tomorrow when the packs come out. Mm. Mm. Rescue Ace, Preventer, Emergency. I know we only got Preventer guaranteed, but Ooh, there's no way they mirror. release Preventer and okay. Emergency. So you... So at this point, I feel like... I think you like want to shotgun the Apo. I think I want to shotgun the Apo. And you could use everybody on board, I think. Or at least everybody except for... You don't have an Ash Blossom in the graveyard, do you? Nope. Nope. So, yeah, if you use... Don't use Sun Life Wolf to add anything that you don't want to summon. Which I don't think is anything. Don't want to do that. Not yet. Not yet. <sighs> Just use everybody. I think so. Gives her more attack power. I guess I could have put... I could have kept What's-His-Face on board, summoned her under him. But I didn't really have anything... If you had an Ash Blossom in, in Grave, I'd say yes. Because now you can summon back uh, your level 1s. And then chain... Um, I'm gonna... Chain I think if you... Barry. If you did that in the opposite order, you might have been able to use Dia Bellstar to discard something. But you can discard the Harpy's Feather Duster. I don't think that's going to be particularly useful. That's dangerous. That's a bummer. That's the interesting thing about the mirror, though, is, like, called by kind of sucks. <sighs> Hitting my... Uh... Hitting my dragon's kind of lousy. I think you may want to craft a second one. I have three. You have three dragons and you're not <laughs> playing two? The other deck only played one, so I just assumed that's what you did. <laughs> oh no, I always play two. 
So I asked if you had, if that was the max number of cards you had. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I might have, I might have dusted one. Two is the appropriate ratio. Shit. Yeah. You want two of them playing. Oh, that's not so bad. Uh, I mean, um, you could apple that. You had original sinful spoil in the imperm column, and you didn't fucking shotgun it. I had no target. There was a DFL star. Off yeah, you, again. Oh, yeah. I could have. I it. instead yeah. of instead of chaining. Right. Sorry. <laughs> no, it's fine. It's just so funny. Why did he put it in the imprint? I know, right? That, that's on him. Like, he, he dodged a bullet. Yeah, he dodged a fucking bullet. You probably didn't know what it was. I guess you you, you don't put Doesn't matter. spells in a... Always assume it's infinite and permanent. What is this, the draw phase? <laughs> is it really? No, it's, it's main phase it's one. Main, it's main phase. Link Karibo. He's out of things to do. He did it again. <laughs> I mean, that's alert. I mean, that that's almost a shotgun the shotgun the infinite impermanence and you, attack you, over his you impermanent draw. Impermanent, yeah. Yeah, yeah. You impermanent draw. Let's see what it is. It's probably also an imperm. Or maybe. Maxi. Sure, whatever. You hey, could guess negate what we're that. not doing. We're not gonna special someone much this turn either, yeah. I we're would I would let it ride. Summoning. I'd let it ride. We don't care. He just looped himself for one. Yeah. We got next turn. Oh. Uh, that's a good target. What did he hit? <sighs> Princess. Princess. That's a terrible target. That turns off his princess. He doesn't Which have is the it. only way he's laddering out of this. He doesn't have it. Poplar. No, like he's on his extra deck. He can't, on his turn now, he can't summon it or he can't use its effect. Yeah, let it ride. Yeah, he can't use it. Let it ride. I mean, yeah, we have a Diabell Star in hand to negate whatever the fuck he summons. There's even an argument to leave Link Karibo on field so he can't dodge Silveria. Mm. It's not very strong. But... No, I would clear his board. Yeah. Just attack. The top decks that get him out of this are... Ash? Smash. Yeah. It's, it's Smash, Oak, and Poplar. Which is a lot of cards. <laughs> it is. Bonfire. But you have the Appaloosa, so... Pretty strong. It was the right call to make it with everybody. Make her big. Yep. We love big women here. I think I'm good. I think you're good. Because you can discard the Diabell Star from hand to activate the trap to maintain field presence. Which is cute. And then you can send the other Diabell Star on the field for the Grave Diabell Star. For more searches. So it doesn't matter what this is, we won. It does not matter what this is. I mean... I guess I'll... Uh, that, oh my gosh! I mean, literally, you, you have to apple that, but like literally that's the one card that... That was a good rip. What, what a top deck. What a rip. I mean... Oh! That doesn't matter, because apple doesn't target. Apple doesn't... Yeah. That's why you didn't use the trap. That's why we didn't use Silveria. Did you know that Silvera is actually a woman? That was turned into a weapon? Mm. Is that the that's new lore a... that just came out? Yeah, that's the new cards. That's how we know that uh, uh, that Diabell Star is gay, you see. Ah, because, see. uh... Hey, that's a good top deck. Activate. 
add, I don't know. Ash, I guess. Uh, or, or oak, but ash is fine. I'm afraid to attack that thing with Apo. Because then it would zero out the attack. And it might, like, bug her up or... You yeah, could, she's not gonna... Could, I don't think she's gonna gain it. You could summon the other Diabell Star. Yeah, you could summon the other Diabell Star. That's fine. For game. That would have been lethal. No, we're good. Alright, we're good. There's nothing you can top deck. Literally nothing. Yeah. I mean, he can scoop at any time. <laughs> He did. <laughs> we're, not, we're not like... You could have ended him last turn, but it's like... Good scoop. Hey, look, you I want a mirror. Why would we do that? I want a mirror. That's actually... And I piloted that one mostly myself. Yeah. I think that I is think a... getting the hang of it. Yeah, I think that's a great place to, to, to stop. One more win, though, Dave. One more win. Can't yeah. end on a mirror match. You got one more win to go up to gold, gold uh, two. All right, let's see if we can do it really quick. Oh, fuck. Sorry. No. <laughs> no. Unacceptable. Uh, sorry, I'll just die then. Fair enough. I actually didn't pay attention to my first second. And, uh, at least mute yourself while you're dying. I was trying to reach the button. <laughs> oh, that's a... I'm not trapped in here with you. That's a weird hand. I hope it we're is. Going. I hope we're going for it. Oh, cool. I, I meant second. I meant second. <laughs> you are going second. Oh, do I ash? I don't know what you mean. Genta oh. of the Dark World? Do you ash Dark Worlds? Oh, God. Add Gates? Yeah, he do wants you... Gates. Gates lets him discard stuff. Ooh. It just feels stupid, because, like, Ooh. it's... It doesn't feel good. the other cards that let him do ha that? Yeah. Half the Dark World cards are bad, so ashing any of them just feels like a waste. <laughs> I'll do that. The new Dark World oh, you just had it? Oh. Yeah, that's the thing. That was that was bait. He just fucking had it. I don't even know if Valor is any good against this deck. Uh, there are choke points. Muhammad, I, I can't max see him to... because I, I don't... Have maxi. You don't have the maxi. <laughs> I don't have maxi. That, that, that's definitely a hindrance on the. Oh, don't maxi it. Yes, because they will just deck you out. I understand. I mean, I get. I have Nibiru, so might be okay. Because they have card destruction usually, so if they just maxi you for twenty you and then card destruction before they get the fusion monster out, because the fusion monster is a an effect replacement. <clears throat> uh, you could Valor that because that's a yeah. That's you a can huge... Valor it when it activates its effect. It's a huge effect. Yeah, I'll Valor that. Most importantly, it's not a Dark World monster. That is important. I really wish I'd went first. Because <laughs> that called by would have been really nice. Yeah. I might be able to hit this dude, though. We'll see. Rainbow is a great card for them to hit. Dark Corridor. That's the worst top deck they could have had. 
That's terrible for us. I could have gone on a high note, guys. Yeah, you could have level up. I mean, we haven't lost yet, right? No, and you have Don't full worry, combo. You can still scoop because he fucked up. And you have full combo in it. <laughs> Bonfire? You the... <laughs> to... He doesn't have Ash Blossom in this deck, right? The only Even thing we're dodging is by. the fusion spell. He's got Nutcracker of the Underworld or whatever. Sack Dragger. This is fine. What happened to our Nibiru? We did not have it in the end. Okay, I think he's out of gas, right? Other than whatever he makes. It all these depends two things. on whether or not he can summon through. Uh, oh, he's got that Summon a uh, skull dread. Which four? We're not a Wu Lord, but the other one. Dark World Ascension. It's a fusion spell. Okay. Yep, that's the fusion spell that discards their cards. He didn't set it? There's nothing in his hand to discard. Mm, okay, so we got we got Black Witch. That's pretty good. <laughs> you, yeah. So bonfire what? for Poplar and go off. I fucking hate you, Dave. <laughs> bonfire for Poplar? God, yeah. I hate you. Yeah, that was a that was a fantastic top deck. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> there you go. There you go. What's that going on in a high note? Dave is never punished. <laughs> we did it. Nope. We did it, boys. There you go. And on the rank up. Man, I, Man, I love level. when I'm I love cruising when through this last 25. Bad deck. I was worried That's about what happens when you play a good deck, Dave. Right? I mean, I still, I don't think I'm still going to finish, but. But yeah, Probably isn't not. it so funny how Dark World has a has a Rota that discards a card? Yeah, that was pretty pretty wild. That's a very that's a creative card. <laughs> yeah, decks have been getting custom cards lately. I guess if they're really bad and old, they basically have to get like a break all the like rules an card structure deck. Pretty much. Can I torment you guys with some uh, special packs? Sure. I wouldn't Long... waste some gems on special packs yet. No, you I get mean, new ones. The, uh, the, le the legacy ones, maybe. Ooh, legacy packs. That I could get behind. Do I have it? probably have a bunch of those. It's in your tickets. Oh, it's in bonus packet. That's what it's called. Oh, wow. I got 100. Let's go. <laughs> let's, I still haven't pulled the blue eyes. Let's open a hundred <laughs> of these bad boys. You have a hundred and thirty. Let's go. Legacy backside. <laughs> they fucking <laughs> suck, man. They are awful. We fucking love legacy packs. There's what's obnoxious is there's a couple of decent cards in it. A couple of them? There's so many. There's a lot of really good ones. They're really pull. annoying that they're in the legacy pack. <clears throat> the fact that we we can't dust these is so obnoxious. For legal reasons, we were required to keep these cards. Because <laughs> like the pull rate of like supers and ultras is so poor that I, it's not like it's gonna like break the like balance of the shopping mechanic I guess they don't want to give you free packs of cards and free cards because then you would never spend your gems in theory you could probably get away with not doing it no I'm not gonna open all 100 packs one by one I'm 
I'm mostly just gonna like open like ten or twenty, and then just to get Ryan. I'm not paying attention. Exactly, he's not paying attention. I'm playing have, Final Fantasy. Because we, we we pulled deadly shit. We pulled deadly squat. We skip when we hit a good card. Limit impulse. Hey, that's a good card. <laughs> you don't even know what it does. Nope. Doesn't matter. <laughs> it's a All good right. card if it ends this month's madness. All right, we got a we got a gold pack. Let's go. Uh huh. We got we got fucking skull stalker. God damn it. It's a great card. You don't you don't know about the skull stalker FTK? <laughs> you know what? It's just like blocker here. <laughs> I'm sure you can technically OTK with any monster. Uh, it's just that some are probably more optimal than others, because, like, you know... Even if it's a normal monster, if it has the right typing, yeah, whatever support, you could possibly cheese out stuff. <laughs> Blocker FTK. Is that that football player? No, it was like a weird little, like, golem man. Hey, oh, man, okay. Magic guards, that's okay. Uh... That actually has support. What is it? I would love to do an OTK where it's like your opponent attacks like a face down and it's got like a million defense and it like ricochets and kills them. <laughs> That'd be funny. Have, have you never seen Rise to Full Height? Is that literally what it is? I mean, that was a Duel Links deck for a while. It, it's the it's the Rock OTK. You bonk in the sure Pretty sure we played that on stream a while Use, back. Use uh, Aztec Statue of the Ancients, and then you set Rise to Full Heights, and then uh, you activate Rise to Full Height, and it doubles the defense up to like sixteen thousand. <laughs> then your opponent gets hit for thirty-two thousand. Nice. Ooh. Unity. Unity. Speed Warrior. Man, we're almost we're almost into thirty packs, and we haven't pulled anything good. We you could probably do all hundred and thirty, and it's not gonna pull anything good. Although that um, um, well that water dude that you played for a bit, blinking on the name, is in the legacy packs. Stealth dragon. Yeah. Stealth dragon. Yeah. I just crafted it though. Yeah. Right. It's like I might have pulled one of the minions at one that point. That sounds familiar. Yeah. The spawn. Oh, right, here we go. Here we go. Gold shiny pack. Let's go. Mm -hmm, what mm -hmm, do we got? Mm -hmm. What do we got? Absolutely nothing. Nothing. Mock you the magical mist. <laughs> Not even a Jim Joe. Cypher Soldier to oh the Bonk TK was the dual links one. <laughs> Bonk TK. You remember that one? Yeah, it was Cypher I Soldier, yeah. Yeah. Uh, I'm skipping. Hey, look! Outstanding dog. That's an outstanding card, Dave. Oh my god. Even I'm tired of this bit. <laughs> <laughs> These packs are so bad, and the color's meaningless. Oh, nice. Yes. I got a, a shiny Gemini Lancer. Fantastic. Look at the card art on this thing. It's fucking terrible. <laughs> oh my god, what is his face? <laughs> <laughs> it's like they gave up. They drew the whole card. They're like, I don't know what the guy. I don't know what this guy's face looks like. I'm just gonna give him a smiley face. So I don't know why that bag was gold. No idea. It doesn't seem to matter for legacy packs, because it's pretty one to one for regular packs. Like if it's gold, there's a super in it. If it's if it's rainbowy, there's an ultra in it. Wow. Oh. I might count Hip Hippo right there. It's a card you know. It's a card I know. It's a card you've played. Hey, the Treaty of Uniform Nomenclature. That's mm. an okay card in, like, a gimmick deck. Mystic Walk and the Great Long Nose. So the neat part about understanding Snake Eyes is you can put the Diabell Star and a small Snake Eyes engine in just about anything. In, like, the Great Long Nose OTK. Sure. Do you think he's done it, Ryan? Stuck his nose in... Uh... <laughs> Just right, once. No. <laughs> Just once. Alright, later, Karen. Bye. <laughs>
<laughs> I take it you must have seen that meme with that dude. No, actually. All right. I just put one and one together. All right, we're skipping, right? I mean, yeah, I would have skipped like a while ago, but oh, look, now we got you. all we got. We got all of our supers. We didn't get a single ultra in a hundred packs. Nope. I mean, thinks the pull ratios are gone. Hey, you know what? Performage Trick Clown though trick is actually a good pull. Not bad. Because like I, Clown Blade. I only ever want one of these anyway. Uh, Trade Toad is the substitute. Substitute. It's terrible. Uh, mm -hmm. Kotodama being a super is really bizarre. Um, and then this is Great a joke. Artwork. This is a joke. <laughs> this has got to be a joke. I'm surprised it's not uh, ultra rare. Right? Claudian. That's, that's okay. We're 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 gonna save the rest of our packs. We're gonna do them in, in hundred hundred batches. Okay. All right. That's gonna be my rule. I'm annoyed that we didn't pull a single ultra though. <laughs> Gotta get that damn blue. Oh, go uh, go back to your your deck real quick and throw in a second flamberge before I forget. Yeah. Because that way you can you can use the field spell to put one in the spell and trap zone. Okay. Instead of one of your other pieces. Oh no, I'd have all three. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, you only need two. I pulled like an absolute champ. Um, the only thing that okay, so like for full power, the only thing you're missing is two original sinful, like the, for a total of three, and then three wanted, and three bonfire, I think, and three poplar. That's the only like you're missing like one of each ultra, which uh, they're nice for consistency, but. It doesn't seem to be a big issue. It does not seem to be a big issue. You want at least two of all the monsters because of called by getting rid of some stuff. But again, unless you're facing Kashtira, the oak just gets things back from Banish too. So it's not even... Probably throw in another Valor. Yeah. Cool. I did it. I didn't see. I didn't see no there. material at all. I didn't see or gore. gores. I mean, I'm leaving gores in. He's a meme. Yes, doesn't do anything. And big eye. That's hilarious. That was in case I ended up in a weird position with Dia Star and gores. I, I don't think. Now that you know how the deck works, I don't think you need that in there. No, I'll never make that. Um, I'm, I'm not sure what to replace it with. It with I think either. If you want to make Kieran mad, go with Ambla Whale. Uh, if you do have her, I would go Underworld Goddess. So you don't have an Ambla Whale. I don't have an Ambla Whale. He is uh, super, so could craft it. Um, this lady. Yeah. You can use. You can also use one monster your opponent controls as material to link summon this card. So well, with IP a... Mascarina, you can on your opponent's turn just for free grab one of their cards because it doesn't target. But it is a destroy. link. It is a link five though, so it requires Correct. a lot of investment. It requires IP and two of your monsters. Gotcha. I'll have to craft it. Let me stick it in just so you remember. I like, um, I, I like I was running. I think I was running an incomplete extra deck. And you could probably run a Cerberus or Phoenix, Nightmare Phoenix. Yeah, that's really, brutal. I guess because I was I left him blank because I wasn't sure what to put in, and we like never needed anything. <laughs> no, you played. You had all the cards you needed. Okay. Um, being able to discard something with with Phoenix is neat. Um, what else? Uh, you could play... No, you don't need that. Zolantis. Yeah, it would be Zolantis, Ambla Whale, and Underworld would be the, the other ones you could add. I don't think you need Cerberus. Okay, I'll put Zolantis in. Because also Nightmare Phoenix is a fire. So you can do stuff with that. Oh, that's cute. 
Uh, how do you make those Atlantis? A Link 4. So, Amblowell would be the target. So, instead of crafting Underworld, you could craft the super rare Amblowell. That might be, for now, your better option. Because I can... Mm -hmm. Might as well generate it, right? I can, I can certainly afford it. Yes. And I don't think you've really dusted much of your supers. No. Yes, Hida is already there. I think that looks better. Okay, cool. Let's... I've actually even gotten... Um, ooh, you can free pack. I've actually even gotten the double draws off a of Unicorn by using Cerberus, or by using uh, Phoenix and Unicorn together. That's funny. Co-linked. Oh, nice. I got a fucking baby. Absolutely nothing. Got gimmick puppet terror, baby. Ooh, Gravity Blaster. That's a cool card. So, that would be with with your cards. I think that would be my suggestions on the deck. Um, we can we can run it another time next week or uh, start start uh, start cooking. Up to you. Okay. But I'll see what congratulations, you have a meta deck. That you basically just pulled. Right. For free. And I, I think I know how to play it. I think you do. More or less. All right. I think that's a great place to end the stream. Fantastic. Thank you, guys. Uh, we'll join us next time. I'm not sure what we're going to be doing next time, but it's probably this. At least we'll start off with this just to... Yeah, we might get the we, rust we, off, and then we, uh, maybe we can do some some deck theory crafting with some fun, fun other stuff. Something fun. Okay. All right, we'll see you guys next How time. How did Dave pull for free? He just pulled like three Dia Bell stars in one ten pack. Go watch the short. It's true. See ya.